That's beautiful. Hi, I'm Rod Tannis from RC Twins. Today I have an AT6 Texan made by Zeroli. Well, it's a kit, and I decide I'd like to put some aluminum skin on it. Well, that's usually a tedious task, but a few things came to mind that when I put stickers on, I use a Windex on the surface, and well, how will that react? Will that help? Let's find out. Okay, so I'll spray the surface up like that. Peel some of this back. I'll just follow this aileron line here because that's easy to do. You to pick something easy to start with. It's going to help to put it down like this. Something like that. Now, like that. Something like this. After you've got this tape stuck down on your wing where you're kind of satisfied with it, it's okay. You can bench and polish it, by the way. And you want a little more pizzazz. You want it to look a little more scale without too much trouble. Like this one over here, for instance, where you got some extra panels and you got these rivets right here. Well, that does class it up quite a bit flexible sanding sponge seems to work pretty nicely and we'll just light pressure the rivets with this tool right here took a piece of brass chamfer the end of the hole on there so that it's a little more pointy now you notice I just with lighter pressure and just a little bit of rotation I can make a rivet like nothing. Voila. You got a contour here, like the end of this wing. Let's do that. Stick this on. Kind of a straight line. Then I'm going to cut some lines in it. to push this down to get it down about halfway about how far I'm going to go anyway So I have some lines right here. You can polish some of those out. I just cut it on the halfway mark. And I'll polish it up the way that I like it. I use a 2K epoxy clear coat and that works very well. It makes a very hard surface. Rod Tannis, RC Twins, all done all through.